So me and my cat walked into the zombie apocalypse and I've trained him on how to use a gun. Surprisingly not the craziest thing I've done and I'm fighting, what is skibbity, get out of here. The more of these guys I kill, the more money they explode into that I get. And occasionally they drop that cardboard box, which will give me a fun little item. And get this toilet out of here. I just need to keep my ability cooldowns on proper timers. That way I can always do something that hurts. I think this is the last guy in my way though. Yes. Stage 11-5, hello. Is that a nurse with a baby zombie? Shoot it, kick it. No, put the baby zombie down. Why is it still alive? I'm okay. Well, I'm not. All right, baby zombies are tough. That's fine. I can merge these gears together to get a level nine body armor that gives me even more health or merge these weapons together to get an actual kitchen knife. And I've got 27 grand. So I think it's time we upgrade some abilities. More gun, more kick, and just two into more HP. I think that just gave me like 2000 more health and one into Oscar's machine gun. Why not? How are we doing now? Okay, yeah, I've got hit twice and I already am like way more more comfortable taking damage. Getting right back to stage 11-4, feeling a lot more comfortable in my ability to murder things. Skibbity toilet, mummies, bring out the dead baby. Quick, light the dead baby on fire, kick it, gun it. Use my other gun ability. Stay back, baby. Why do you have so much damage? Get these stupid mummies out of here too. No, there's more babies in toilets. There's so many. It's like a giant dog pile. Well, how am I going to get past this? Answer, upgrade into the Jason hockey mask. And then we can upgrade into the hammer. All right, full upgrade Oscar, all to one level. I guess lucky 13 to my crit and I can sell my soul for some things. Wait, hang on. The code just came to me in a dream. Answer, dang it, 152, I was actually close. And I didn't get any new gear. So I guess it's just time for me to go kill these guys for a bit to farm money. Back to 11-5 and I've already killed a couple of the baby zombies. I might be able to actually get through this just with my proper abilities like so. Is it just one nurse standing in my way? Yeah, wow. Stage 11 cleared and I'm moving on to the tier 10 wrench. Am I playing Liza P now? Here, Oscar, have some food. And I think now i'm just going to upgrade my power twice i do like an extra 50 damage per smack okay looks like the nurse baby zombies are going to be a recurring enemy though that might be a problem stage 12 so far been pretty chill all right well let's just keep doing some kicks and there's okay well stage 12 5 just put three baby nurses in front of me and then, oh now there's the doctor who throws syringes stop i'm gonna get tetanus that's probably the worst virus that's floating around right now i'd say <laughs> stage 12 cleared though thank you hitting zombies with a little murder death mayhem seems to always work out oh and tier 10 headgear. I look stupid. However, upgrading Oscar's power. Well, that feels smart. All right. Stage 13 is getting a little more tough because these guys can just harpoon me from like nine light years away. Oh, grandma. Oh, I'm dead. Grandma jump scare results in my untimely demise. Who would have thought? All right, Oscar. Let's get you some more base power. And if I merge all my weapons, I can get a diamond sword. I would not have expected that, but I'll take it. Can I merge my body gear too? Oh yeah. More armor, more damage, more cat food for Oscar. Let's just give that a go. My diamond sword lets me do 230 nine now every slash that should be pretty helpful i've made it to 13 4 i don't know if i'm feeling confident though these guys hurt a lot and now there's two grandmas in front of me it's like everything that's bad about this world no quit throwing these syringes at me and then just also die get flamethrowered kicked come on i just need like yes i was able to make it through oh 13 5 though this is a whole different beast oh no zombie kitchen ladies with axes <laughs> i had a nightmare like this in high school once i'm already dead that does so much damage well, at least I was able to upgrade my hat. Now let's also upgrade my kick. Maybe that's what I need to do. Just more ability damage. Got to 13-4. So far feeling confident. No longer feeling confident. A lot of enemies right here. Use my abilities. No, I see more babies coming. Oh, that's so much damage. Stop. Oh, that hurts. That hurts my life. Maybe I need to dump into HP. And claw ability for Oscar. Well, I've made it back to 13-5. Thanks to my extra little HP. I didn't think that was actually going to be the world's biggest difference maker. But what do you know? It's currently being the world's biggest difference maker and i'm right on through yes that nets me my level 11 gear which is a tortoise shell i think my level 12 weapon is a <laughs> just normal pickaxe and yeah clearly just dumping into my health very helpful because that big old circle that's where a boss is waiting for me and it'd be rude to keep him there for any longer than he needs to be i might have done a little grinding letting me go to level 12 huh look like rce now merge these up giving me my level 12 armor and will i get level 13 weapon i will big old machete Oh my gosh. I've also got $67,000. Might as well upgrade Oscar's abilities. Can give myself some more crit damage, some more basic power, and we'll upgrade the gun again. Now let's see if I can actually manage to beat stage 14. Seems like all these upgrades are actually helping a whole bunch. Getting to 14-3 and still having at least half of my health makes me feel a little bit more hopeful. However, I'm getting a lot of needles chucked at me, so I'm about to take that back. The stupid baby and nurse out of here. Stage 14-4, trying to hang in best I can. I've still got good abilities 
ability cooldown usage going right now. And half my HP, hopefully I, yep, just keep decapitating everybody. If I start feeling guilt, I just need to remember that they deserve it because they've been annoying me this whole time. All right, 14-5, I believe. Kill all of these doctors. Use the flamethrower, do some more damage over time. This is why we upgrade Oscar's abilities. No, baby zombie, get AK'd. And there's still more of everybody up here. That's fine. Oscar's got three abilities ready. They're flamethrowering, they're hurting, they're burning. <laughs> yes. Oh, it feels good. It's like an epiphany, an epiphany in my brain of how much I enjoy murdering these things. And now if I auto merge all of these. Oh man, I thought I'd get level 14. Will I get level 13 with you? I do. More armor, more HP. And speaking of more HP, let's get 2200 more health and some more crit. Now I just need to make it through this all the way to stage 15 and I'll be able to fight some stupid ugly boss. Stage one cleared fine. I'm liking how well everything's going so far. Although it does make me curious, is the boss going to ruin my day by not going well? Is this all a ploy to get me to lower my guard? I don't know. My therapist says I have trust issues and I just can't really trust her opinion on it. 15-4, I get through this. I'm fighting the boss. All they did was put my three least favorite enemies in front of me. And yes, I cleared. Who's the boss this time? It's a giant bat? I wasn't expecting this, I'll be honest. Luckily, it's just sitting there. Okay, I had to talk. I had to talk and say something. Now I'm being batted. I'll just keep spamming all my ability buttons because I pretty much want to do them as fast as possible. There's good damage across the board right now, but I don't know if he's got any other moves hidden away. He just keeps throwing these things at me. Keep AKing, keep damaging. The ability damage is really coming in clutch right now. I can't lie. And he is dead. Screw you, stupid bat. Come on, hit it. Hit it, Oscar. Yeah, all right. All right, new item. Grenades? Oh, I like the sound of that. All right, merge my gear. I get a new little biker helmet, a new little chest piece, and I'd say even a new hatchet weapon. All level 14. I'm looking good. Let's make sure we get this grenade damage going up too. And some machine gun. Why not? Stage 16 is here. At stage 20, I get to fight that stupid final boss. Get these dogs out of here. Oh, weird this weird little earthworm pop up from. That is disgusting. Down, boy. Stop it. God, it's like second grade all over again. Oh, hey, do the grenade ability too. I haven't seen that yet. That's a big chunk. I feel like I should just do that when there's a group of enemies. Like, I don't know, a group of dogs lined up. Is it weird that these guys aren't really doing as much damage to me? I feel like they're easy. All the way up to 16-4 and cleared extremely simply to move on to 16-5. Alright, uh, well, yeah, grenade. Thank you. Just, yep, keep ability spamming. We got them. They're on fire. They're burning. They're getting clawed. They're getting murderized. Who is this? SWAT zombie? He does 473 damage to me. Oh my gosh. I'm so close. Please, grenades, flamethrowers, let me go free. I I don't like what's hanging out on the edge of my screen over there. He's got an ooze thrower. An ooze oozer? I don't what, whatever you call it. Use my AK to murder him. Whatever it is, I don't want to deal with it. All right, get me out of stage 17. This lets me merge into a better weapon and merge into more health. I'm a prospector now. Speaking of more health, dump on into that. Oh, there's like a new general zombie thing now. I don't like that because I do not have much HP left. Can we? No, they're practically dead though. Dang it. Maybe it's time to grind up to like day 43. Give me one second. Oh, I was grinding, but then I found a new enemy with chainsaw hands. Everything has changed. My whole worldview has shifted. All right, now we grind. Well, here at day 43, I've got the level 16 helmet, the level 16 chest piece, and now probably the level seven, no, the level 17 sword, hello, as well as $98,000, which I'll be dumping into Oscar's grenade, then his machine gun, as well as my kick and gun, and then just some normal power. Also, I'm on stage 19 now because I'm accidentally really good at what I do, but hello, all new enemies. Everyone get kicked a bunch. Dude, there's still so many and I'm about to die. What? This is stage one? Level one of stage 19 and I'm dead. Okay. I decided to try drinking the coffee to give me double power. It's literally only good to get past one stage, but screw it. Why not? Just, yep, clear right through. Thank you. No, not chainsaw arms. That's like my least favorite guy and my coffee's about to wear off. Don't worry. It let me get through stage two at least. Oh, there is a lot of people here. Hello. I'm just going to queue up all of my abilities, which seems like that still wasn't even enough for all of this. All right. Clearly I need to level up my health helmet and chest piece some more. Well, with those upgrades, I'm able to get back to world 19-3. I'm not happy about it. I mean, it still takes a while, but at least it's not a total loss. Two chainsaw arm havers in one level. That should be a federal offense. God, I was so close. I just need to kill two more spewers. That's fine. Combine all my gear. New weapon now. No, we're getting there. Oh, 
Oh, weapon level 16 was a katana. I just never got to see it. Oh, more HP. Yes. Well, I made it to 19.5 after I upgraded my helmet, armor, and weapon once more. So if I can at least manage to get through this, then I'm on to the final stage. And I'm so tired of seeing these ugly losers. It's like my high school reunion after I got super famous and popular. I'm also coping when I say that. Stage 19 done. All sorts of new things. Throw them in. I've got $160,000. I just need to upgrade HP. Guaranteed. All right, stage 20. What do you got? Just a whole bunch of big old losers I've killed already. Stage 20-3. And I'm still making it out of here with at least a quarter of my health. Let me just get through 20-4 real quick by just feigning confidence. Am I afraid? Absolutely. Will I show it? No. Cat claws, grenades flamethrowers, kicking. There's so many Chainsaw Men just all right here. It was like a rejected episode of Chainsaw Man for a second. Just die. I hate you guys. Get grenaded. Get military weaponed. Get something illegal that I made in my basement. Hopefully this will just be the last little bit that I need though. Gun to the face. It never lets me down. <laughs> yes. Come here, Mr. Boss. Immediately do everything. Oh, it's a gross giant cop. Die. You're just way too big for human like eyes. Are you sicking something at me? Oh, you sent a dog out. I didn't know you'd be a minion user. Keep doing all these abilities. Come on. Gosh, this is so annoying. I'll just wait till he summons out a dog and then use more abilities. Specifically all of them. Oh my gosh. No. The dogs keep tanking all his attacks and then doing more damage to me. So I'm not able to kill him. Dang it. All right. More power then. Gives me a new armor piece. Well, I'm going to upgrade Oscar a whole bunch and I've got some new gear. Time to go give this boss a piece of my mind again. Hello, you stupid cop. I'll wait till he summons out a dog after I use a few abilities because then I can chuck the grenade at him. That'll hit the dog. I can kick the dog in the face and he's constantly still taking flame damage. By the time he summons out the next dog, I'll have some more abilities ready. This is good. We're making good progress. Perfectly timed grenade onto the dog. Get kicked. Get flamethrowered. This is a great cycle I've got going right now, I think. He's below half health. Dog is dead. Shoot him. Good 1700 damage. More grenade, more flamethrower, more kick in his groin. He's going down and this time it's not just to the Duncan store. All right, my ADHD is kicking and I'm going into double speed. I can't take this slow-mo stuff anymore. Get grenaded. You know what? I'm just going to spam number keys until you end up in the dirt. This will work eventually. Yes! Hit it, Oscar. Yes! You know it. Good job, buddy. Oh, I'm free. I'm free. I'm like a genie in a bottle. Let loose, finally. I need to start the vehicle now to get out of here. Gosh, just go off vibes. These puzzles are always so simple. Oh, I'm free. Screw zombies. I'm going to go take a five-hour nap now. As always, though, thanks for watching. I'll see you.